Hello, 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 and welcome to another episode of a Crazy Town Gaming. My name is Jonas, I'm your host, and I'm here with TNT Dynamite, the explosive one, Jonas. I'm the man on the sticks, and I'm yes, pour- we're playing uh, the, the, the game, dude. You got a seed, dude. It's uh, the game where you're Link, and you fight Ganon, dude, and Princess Zelda's like, yo, help me again. I'm like, chick. That's a big chest. Help me help oh, you. Oh, there's two. It is too. Opal, Ooh. give me that. Girl, give me things. What's in here? Is it a mimic? In a blazon the shield? But it's only a three. But is it's that, a beautiful. I wonder if you could sell it for money, dude. It's it like might a be. ornamental shield. Maybe. That, there's definitely If a you chance. were like a man who had to use a shield to, to like be. Protect myself? Yeah, would you use a. a, a a really tough shield that was ugly, or would you use a partially less protective shield that was, like, are elegant? You, are you asking me if I value functionality over aesthetics? Yes, essentially. Okay, um... I mean, it, okay, so... Part of me thinks that you would say you would take some, some aesthetic over the pure function. Alright, so here we go. This is the thing. If <laughs> I'm going to war, Jonas, then, like I said, I'm cost-effectiveness versus not getting hurt 100,000%. Right, 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 right. That, that makes sense. But if I'm just, like, going to, like, the you know, the castle well, ball or something, then, yeah, I'm putting my fresh shield on. <laughs> your <laughs> fresh shield. <laughs> going out to the pub for the night, you're gonna... Yeah, yeah dude. You're like, just... I'll put, be protected if, if Ish jumps off a little bit. Yeah, but if I'm just going to hang out with some winches... <laughs> <laughs> That's what you do if you're rocking shields, right? I figure if you're rocking a shield, you're hanging out with winches. Isn't that what they called loose women? In the <laughs> <laughs> yeah, kind of. I remember going to the medieval fair as a kid, and this lady came around, and she called herself the kissing wench. And she had on like a real... She was like... She wasn't a small lady, but she wasn't like... She was kind of thick, but it was before thick was a term. Ah. And uh, she had on like a girdle and like she had real big cleavage popping out of her shirt and she was like kissing people on the cheek, but she had on like a ton of lipstick. So she'd leave like kiss prints on your cheek and you'd see a bunch of people walking around with like a lipstick kiss mark on their uh, on their cheek. She's like, oh, I'm the kissing wench. And she would like and we were like 15 year old boys. And we were like, oh, kiss me on the cheek. Never that, had one of those before. That was a crazy explosion. That was really big. <laughs> that was nuts, dude. Was that a bomb arrow? No, that was a fire boy. Um, I, you know what, Jonas? I remember like getting kisses was a big thing. I'm, I'm kind of you know like whatever, dude. Well, now it's like, <laughs> like uh, I don't know. now it like it's funny because like I was like kiss my the old mind. wow <laughs> the older you get the the more you're like oh yeah just a kiss dude whatever yeah like, you know, like when you're like younger and you're like should I kiss her dude should I re- <laughs> should I lean in and give her a smoocherino Here and then you go, like dude I'm gonna give you ask her first how about that you know yeah and then uh like you but then there okay now there's the debate though like. It's like, like if, if like you if you want to if you want to kiss someone, and you're on like a date, does it ruin the moment if you ask? <sighs> because sometimes it's about taking the initiative to kiss them, but at the same time, it's not like putting a kiss on someone who doesn't want to be kissed. Yeah, is, is not you know what I mean? So it's like that. Yeah. See, I don't know if I'm. I don't know, man, because like, yeah, being being a man and just getting in there and kissing the girl, yeah, dude, just getting there and kiss her, dude, yeah, that's great and all, but then when she's like, uh, I'm calling the police. Right, you force yourself on me. Yeah, exactly. It's like, but then at the same time, if you're interested in a girl, too, so you said, can I kiss you? I mean, <laughs> there's more G ways to say well, it, though. You'd be like, I really just want to kiss you right now, girl. Ooh, well, you don't right. call her a girl though. No, no I, I feel you, but like, you sound like Justin. It's like because you know the whole like time, the the whole like thing you know from back in the day, and, and we're in way different times than we were then. It was like you know, it, you know, if you're interested, just lean in for that kiss at the end of the night. You know what I mean? It's right. like, but there's also a respectable way to do it and a non-respectable way to do it too. <sighs> yeah, you know, it's dude, like yeah, and there's a way that you look like a just a little bee trying to do it, and a way to not look like a little bee, right? But I would err on the side of caution myself, man. Oh, anymore, know. especially, yeah. Roasted like, I mean, acorn. Oh, you can just pop them in the, in the thing, dude. You can just pop them in your mouth. Just suck on them, dude. Put them between your jaw and your gum line. <laughs> I'm going to roast you an acorn. You can just put one in your... in your. I actually hear roasted acorns is, are pretty good. Really? Yeah. Like if you season them and stuff. Kind of oh. like pumpkin seeds. You, do you, oh! Are you a seed boy? Oh, I've never... I, I do sunflower seeds, but... So you're not a pumpkin seed boy? 
No, I've never actually had one. Are they all right? Uh, they're similar to like any other seed. You got to shell them and everything. In yeah, your mouth. I kind of like eating uh, sunflower Ooh. seeds because like I, I I always have a craving for like salty, crunchy snacks, you know, and like I feel like sunflower seeds kind of fit that because they're very salty. But yeah. you got to like work at them to like get the little bit of snack out of them. So oh. it's like you get the salty, crunchy fix without like having to eat a lot of like junk food. Jonas, man. Every time I think about sunflower seeds, I just think about how my a hole hated me for eating them. But yeah, really? They, they don't Do you not... eat the shells or something? <laughs> All right, Jonas, man. I know that I've told the story before, but hey, I don't it, remember it. We're going to tell the story I, yeah. again. All right, yeah, do so it. I remember I, I was eating a bag of sunflower seeds. And I was just like, man, this is a lot of work. You know, like I got to shell every single seed. I was like, I bet you I could just eat the whole thing. So I just like started eating the sunflower seed in its entirety. Like was, crunching it up though, right? Yeah, I'd chew them, and then I just swallow all of the sunflower seed okay. stuff, dude. But that sounds dangerous, but okay. It, I, I mean, I take it this is where the story's going. Oh, aside from the the the, uh, the initial danger, it was it was fine. I had a, a good time. I ate a whole bag over. You know, it takes like a day to eat a bag of yeah, sunflower seeds. Yeah, like that's the thing. Like you can't eat a whole, a whole bag of sunflower seeds. But yeah, so I. Oh, this is not good. One time I ate way too many and my tongue got all like raw from all the salt. <laughs> Anyways. Yeah. But uh so I ate the sunflower seeds, dude, and then um the next day I had to take a poop, Jonas, and it was kinda like I pooped a hedgehog. Oh, it was like uh it was like you pooped out the spike shell from Mario Kart. Yeah, dude, it was not a good look. It was not a good feeling, it was not an enjoyable time. <laughs> I could imagine. I wasn't amused. <laughs> You're like, I've made a terrible mistake. Basically, I made a terrible mistake. <laughs> Basically, I just made a terrible mistake. Um, so I, I didn't learn my lesson that you should probably just go ahead and shell them bees. Yeah, and what's funny is like I bought the bag of pre-shelled sunflower seeds. Yeah. I don't like them nearly as much. If you mm. can just eat a handful of them bees, like I'm not into that. You probably could just use a regular arrow and not waste a fire boy or a bomb boy. Is that right? And it just went out to hit the water. Is that right? Can I just use... I don't know if I can use regular arrows on these I think... Dude, if you, if you shot a... I don't know. Maybe, dude. <laughs> yeah, video games, man. I'm yeah, that's saying. what it would make me think that you could just... <laughs> yeah, all right. Fair enough. Yeah. All right, Jones. Make sure to uh, go ahead and take your word for it again. Why don't you throw a bomb? Why don't you not tell me how to live my life? Wasting all your arrows, dude. Uh, dude. You were literally telling me in one episode, Jonas, to just use arrows to hunt wildlife. What, what did you get out of that? Apples? I don't know. I thought there might be like a secret enemy or something. Oh, well, yeah, me too. Like, all you got was a baked apple. That's stupid. Yeah, well, it's fine. It's all right, dude. Arrow on the side of caution, dude. I see a bunch of arrow. I see a bunch of barrels in a circle. I'm going to yeah, freaking make them blow, blow them up, all dude. up. Yeah, but uh, yeah, I don't know, Jonas. I'm not into uh, I'm not into seeds anymore. I don't really f with sunflower seeds. But if I do, Jonas, what what's like your flavor? Are you going Just with plain, the ranch boys? Plain salt. Just salt. And dude, I want the salt. That's why I eat them. I don't like the seed. I just want to eat this. I just want salt. The hell are you? She's crying. Oh, oh, it's a person, dude. I couldn't tell what that was. I was ready to <laughs> kill it, dude. It was making noises. What's I'll wrong? Bend over and I want, I need, oh, girl, what you need? <laughs> grilled salmon. Wait, she's standing there crying in a field because she wants grilled salmon? Who got time for this? And also. Oh, my good, typical woman. What? <laughs> <laughs> the hero's life. Oh, dude. Okay, so I fought one of these boys. They are not to be trifled with. So I'm going to pull out a, I'm actually going to pull out my boomerang. And we're gonna give this a shot. These guys are not to be trifled with. Yeah. Wow. So they like they yeah, ruse dude. you, dude. They do. Oh god. Oh my god. Do you god. see the damage, dude? I was trying to charge yeah, up and an attack. Yeah, you're gonna use a weapon that you're not not like no, fooling with. No, I was trying to charge it up. That's really I was just trying to get as much damage as I could out there. We're gonna eat something that gives me defense too. I think. What does this give me? Speed? Yeah, it gives you speed. Dude. Do I have any defensive meat? I do have. <laughs> to... 
This Do gives I have me any defensive meat? This gives me attack. This gives me defense. So this will give me more. There we go. Mm. There you go. You got some defensive meat now, you got dude. Some D meat, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Your favorite kind. Look, this other person's just like that. I see nothing. Where are you at? Oh god. Dude, you gotta chill the f out. Okay, you know what? You're just I gonna. Don't, this guy is super fast. Like, let me use my boomerang. Let Listen, Jarvis. <laughs> like, you have like Listen. big old weapons. All right, dude. Fine. Well, I mean, it's hard to attack him with like regular weapons because of his speed. And yeah, his, dude. His... Like, what'd you do the last one? Did you just run, or what'd you do? Uh, I just like lamed it out a little bit. Can you use a bomb? Your bomb method? Uh, the bomb method? Where you throw a bomb and let him come to it and blow it up? Oh, that, that's a possibility. Let's see. Come on at me, fam. What are you going to do? Okay, yeah, that didn't work because he's super fast. Um, we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna do this. We're gonna get past this guy. He's not gonna kill I, me. I think that you're right. He's not gonna kill me. I'm going to eat a roasted acorn. Nope, I'm gonna eat the steak, and I'm gonna eat this apple, and I'm gonna eat this roasted acorn, and I'm gonna eat this other. I don't even need to eat the apple. All right, fine. Yeah, he's fast, dude. He's very lot. fast. Wow. All right, you know what? I was pressing the wrong. God dang it, dude! I was pressing the wrong button to, um, please. I was pressing the wrong button to, uh, to use the boomerang, and that's that's where the problem was. I wasn't pressing the yeet button. There we go. Yeet. Oh, where did it go? Oh, you got it. Okay. Oh, you hit him! Oh, got you on the backswing, B word. Give me this mighty banana. Oh, he eh. gave you a rupee. He, he gave, gave you some banana. Oh, a red rupee. Those are worth more because yeah. now, now you have 98 rupees. Yeah, ru red rupees are 20, Jonas. Vicious sickle. Got my hammer and my sickle. Yeah, and if you uh, take a look, I already got one vicious sickle that I got from the other one that I encountered. So, yeah, dude, that was that was very interesting. I need, I need salmon. Oh, look over to your right, dude. Wait, what am I looking for? Other right. Keep going. Oh, you came from over there. Never mind. Derp. Um, but yeah, man. So they just got like guys who will just like jump you well, that's in funny. the middle She's of the all wilderness. like, boohoo, I want some salmon. And it's like, hey, I want to kill you. It's like, wow. Yeah, that okay. was not very nice. Not a, not a nice lady. Not yeah. a nice, not a nice oh, man. You're nice, dude. You got some big old weapons. I do. I got some decent weps. I got some Ned and Wep. <laughs> Say it, Jones. You like Ned and Wep. <laughs> God, dude. Dude, I don't I, know. I'm going to find some of that on the internet and order it for you. Um, I've actually looked it up, and you can order it. How much is it? it is, I mean, you can't just, like, order a single can of nothing. Oh, dang. Like, what's the name of the stuff again? Not, was, the brand, not the flavor, the actual stuff. It was Whoop Dub, dude. <laughs> whoop Dub, I think, or Whoop Dab, or Whoop, whoop something. Yeah. Whoop Dub. Whoop Dab. Yeah. Whoop something? I, yeah, whoop dub. That's what it whoop was. Whoop dub. Yeah. Yeah, I got it. I'm sorry that I just ruined your whole life. Yeah, I wonder how much it would cost to order some of that stuff. Farming hoe. Oh, it's 16? Jesus. Yeah, I know, right? That's a strong hoe. Now delivering right to your front door. Never had a hoe so strong. <laughs> Punk slap. Punk slap. There's punk slap? Dude. I thought it was... Oh, wait. No, it was punk slap. Blue balls. Blue balls and, 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 and wet. wet. Yeah. Jesus. Punk Christ. slap. What the heck does punk slap even mean? Dude, they're just slapping punks, dude. Come on. <laughs> slapping punks. Oh come on. God. I mean, come on. <laughs> yeah, dude. I'm sorry. I'm sorry I questioned it now. Yeah, why are you, so why if are you, you don't acting know, if, like you don't know? If you don't know Frothy Whoop Dub. So if you don't know what we're talking about, we're talking about the ICP inspired uh Beer. It's beer and juice though, I think. Yeah, it's Oh They're, wait, you can order singles. Sixteen ounce singles. They're yeah. eight dollars a piece. Eight dollars for one? For one sixteen ounce. 
24 wow. bucks for all three. That seems like a little excessive. Because, yeah, like, you buy a, what, a 16-ounce can of craft... Well, I guess a 16-ounce craft beer at the bar is like 8 bucks, probably. Muff, this ain't no craft beer. This is an icy It says clown craft beer. My, this is <laughs> clown craft beer. You a clown if you buy it. Man, you I would have bought some if it wasn't $24. <laughs> $24? <laughs> for three of them, for one of each, dude. We could have split them. Eight ounces of <laughs> We could have split them. I need my own I would have poured slap. it in a glass, dude. Nah, I need my own punk slap. I'm sorry. <laughs> I don't know who you I'm think I'm so I curious am. what they taste like. I am, Because it's going to be awful. Like I said, man, I might order some. I'm I'm definitely, like, I. that's an experience that I feel is worth the investment. www.icp.beer. That's the website. All right. There Noted. you go. Noted. Telling everyone, all of our fans. <laughs> Dude, I just don't. Oh, look at him standing on a rock poking you with a pitchfork like a. Why do you beast. have a mop? Whoa! Dude, they're dangerous. Yeah, the blue boys are always stronger. Yeah, but man, they're like extra dangerous because they're in this new area and they have like gardening utensils and stuff. <laughs> you want all you right. to you be. You mother fricker, dude. I just go through food so fast. Yeah, dude. You got to like, every time you hit a place, cook up some new grub. Nah, I mean. We, Do you remember your, uh, did that say steamed meat? Yeah, I just dude. made some steamed meat, dude. You ever had steamed meat? It sounds disgusting. Steamed steak? Uh, it's like milk steak. I've never had that. Milk. Is that what milk steak is? Is literally just steak cooked in milk? I believe so, yes. It sounds disgusting. It does sound gross. Uh, let me look. So, there was actually a, um, what do you call it? There was a company in Japan, I think, or China, that made beer that was mixed with milk. That sounds gross. And it was called Bilk. <laughs> what? It was called Bilk. Bilk. Beer, beer milk. Ew. Uh, they went out of business, funny enough. <laughs> the milk steak Charlie refers to is a literal steak boiled in milk. What does that do? Does it does that like have a taste that is like good? Is that a good tasting? Food? Oh, here's a here's a uh, no stupid questions on Reddit. Uh, I swear, milk steak has been a thing. I've heard of for ages, but when I Google it, all I get is it's always sunny references. Oh crap! Oh, I guess it says they were in a room in the writing room, and someone wanted a milkshake, and they heard milk steak. And they like, and that's where they like brought it into an episode. <laughs> that actually, that's actually a good way to bring it up, though. He well, milk, milk steak hard over jelly beans. He just wanted like a steak boiled in milk served over oh, jelly beans. <laughs> that doesn't sound appetizing at all. No, dude. Imagine just getting like a nice like filet mignon, tossing it in some hole, <laughs> boiling it for till it's cooked. Toss that into some milk, dude, and just eat it up, dude. That's gross. Like, I like milk a lot, and I like steak a lot. I would never, like... You like milk? Oh, dude, I, I like... Dude, but it's it a does... I know, it's a problem! It doesn't taste like anything. Oh, it tastes so good, dude. Oh, my God. Dude, you're a big boy, and you discovered me. Use, use that garden. Oh, my God! He swung he down do on you with a fury. He's a beast. Your farming hoe has no... Okay, so these weapons are strong, but they have no no durability whatsoever. What'd you drop for me? Moblin. I need that. Give me that. Give me this too. Don't run. Too yeah. Much. Um. Yeah, that makes sense. Like, yeah, you, like like you hit him with a hoe and it would hurt, but like it breaks and <laughs> that would hurt. Do you imagine if somebody hit you with a hoe? That would hurt like a bee, dude. <laughs> I hit that hoe back. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Wow. <laughs> I would, though, man. I'm <laughs> We're talking about a gardening tool, are we not? Yeah, you're gonna hit. A, you're gonna hit. Hit back the gardening tool. <laughs> hit that garden tool right back, dude. <laughs> Wait, are you going the opposite way that we're supposed to go? No, not really. Because like the little dot. I know where the dot uh, is. Oh, dude, you can like go on like a fly adventure. Yeah, get up higher, that's dude. That's kind of what I was thinking. I was <gasps> I was trying to get up high so I could see what there was. To oh, there's see. a there's another temple out there, dude. You don't freak. Oh, it's right where we have to go. It looks like exact mundo buddy balls. Buddy balls, dude. What is up with my sensitivity? How do you place a pin? A button. 
That's kind of close to it. All right, now there's eight. Fine. <laughs> we'll just have eight pins. All right, we're going to fly across. Okay. So this is like unexplored territory. What are you? Can I just eat you? Can I just like take a bite out of your fox face? Is that how you would treat an animal? <laughs> what? Take I mean, a bite out of their fox face? Jonas, look. <laughs> I know it's hard to believe, but uh, people have been eating animals for a long Not time foxes, here. foxes, though, dude. They're all like... Furry and cute. Um, yeah, oh yeah. It's even worse because we just kill the fox and then take their furs and wear them. Yeah, you know, take a look. Is that man. what people do? Oh yeah, yeah fox furs a thing, yeah, huh? It was a very thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We don't even eat the meat because the meat's not good. It's not even good to eat. We just feed it to pigs. <laughs> wow. <laughs> That's, Is that what happens? Yeah, dude. Not good meat just gets fed to pigs. There are a lot of boys over here. Pigs gotta eat though. I don't want any. Oh my god, you took no damage yeah, from that. Dude, you, you, uh. You like those bombs are nice and all, but like. They, I mean, they're not bad at doing their job. They're just not, like, excellent. They're at just doing not, their like, good either. Yeah. I mean, any damn. What the hell? Where the hell did you come from? Why did you damage your farming hole so badly, dude? Ooh, threw it in his chest. Do you see his chest recoil? From the damage dealt by yeah, dude. He uh, he hug hugged the bomb, and then you oh, that's friends. All right, accidentally crouched. That's fine. Bound to happen once. Bound to happen once. Are you blocking my hits? <laughs> Are you? Oh, he turned into like a coal man. He did. Shield of the Mind's Ooh. Eye. Dude, I'm getting some good shields all of a sudden that yeah, I'm never going to use. For sure. Where are you going? He's scared, dude. He's running away now. Oh. Ooh, headshot. Derp, 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 Headshot. Derp, 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 derp. See, now that... Oh, man. I alerted the troops. <laughs> <laughs> I alerted everybody. Everyone is coming. Everybody knows I'm here now. Could you stop hitting me? Um, no, oh. he will never stop. Can't stop. <laughs> won't stop. <laughs> you good over there, fam? I'm, dude, I'm great. <laughs> you, ha 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 ha. You sure you good? You good? Tell me that they won't stop. Ha ha ha. Tell me that way they won't stop. What is this? Another strong man? Give me your serpentine spear. Dude, there's so many weapons, dude. I didn't know this game had this many weapons. Yeah, and you're still in, like, the very beginning. I know, and there's a ton of different things, dude. I'm so pleased with the amount of versatility and... You're dead. Oh, you just are a dirty girl, huh? You're just going to come up and smack me in the back. I don't want these Boko clubs, though. I just picked up 17 Boko clubs. Aw, the Boko boys, dude. That's the last thing that I want. Hey, right, get this get this thing out of my inventory. Eat this into the stratosphere. <laughs> and then we'll, we'll keep the other one in case I need the beat on a tree or something. All right, man. I, I handled the enemies. You and, did. You made uh, him pay. And blazing the shield, dude. We know that this is not good. So yeah, it just looks pretty. Oh, good. I didn't want that sword. Cool. All right. All right. Making some freaking headway. Oh, look at that. You got glowing what things is, out yeah, there. Yeah, dude. What's over here? A glow shroom, dude? I can't tell if these are enemies. <laughs> oh, spicy peps. This is definitely an enemy, right? Sneak <laughs> strike, dude. Ooh, I'm sorry. Did you not wake up? <laughs> Aww, he just went to bed and his life ended. Hardy radish, Jonas? Whoa! It's two and a half hearts by itself, dude. That's it's crazy. It's gonna give you a billion hearts. Moblin spirit sucks. <laughs> you had like the excited voice and then like, <laughs> oh my oh! Well, look, it's better than this freaking Boko bust. I think the spears do a lot of damage when you throw them. 
but they don't do like a lot of damage as weapons themselves. Oh, I got you. <laughs> you know, it, it, like uh, this reminds me. I was listening to like a, a podcast the other day. Okay. And they were talking about like uh, how the sword is like such a cool weapon. Okay. And how like there's like you know like uh, the green what is it the green eyes dragon sword from the movie and there's the freaking Ragnarok and there's Excalibur and there's all of these like just great swords of the throughout the ages and everything but really the most used weapon was just like a long stick with a blade on the end the spear is like way more heavily used well cuz it's like a, it's a distance weapon I mean, and it's you can, still like, poke someone with a knife. It hurts. It's still like a close up weapon, but it's just the fact that everybody's always like out here blowing the sword because it's just cool. But really, it's not that cool. It's I mean, it's not the most used weapons really. I'm trying to say, I guess. Well, I appreciate oh, my God. That. So I thought that that was uh, it's very it's very crazy that when you brought up earlier an episode about which which shield I would use, the cool shield or the more functional one. Yes. Seems like people want to use the cool sword instead of the, you know, the spear, which would just win every single time. Well, I win every single time. All right, Jones, on the next episode. <laughs> Give you, give you, give you a little breather. <laughs> so you can come back with some, with some quality. Oh, uh, whatever, dude. I Next don't episode. Need quality. <laughs> Next episode. That is, that is all the time we have for today's episode. Please make sure to like and subscribe if you've already done that. Uh, you know, come back with some quality and subscribe. Yeah, to come him. back with some freaking quality, dude. TNT Dynamite Man, I'm on stream every single day. That's Switch.tv. T and T D I N O M I G H T underscore Crazy Town nine a.m. Central Hangout. Your Jones. boy, TNT. We'll catch you on the next one. We are out. Let go, dude.